guys, this is Ashley back with another video. Before we get into the video, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. So let's start off with Dolja Cat because this is some confirmed tea. Um, like two months ago, I told you guys that Dolja Cat was going to be pushing another record after woman. Okay, and it looks like she is pushing get into it, yeah. Okay, now am I shocked? No. Because that was a fan favorite. Um, but I don't know why she didn't push it earlier. But I feel like she did that because maybe she wanted a certain someone to hop on the song. Okay? Now, if you guys remember, that's the song that Nicki Minaj was supposed to be on. Okay? But she felt like she couldn't add anything, allegedly. Uh, with that being said, I think she was hoping... That just maybe Nikki would hop on the remix. Okay, but it doesn't look like there's going to be a remix. Now, I see a lot of fans hoping that Nicki Minaj would be in the music video. But why would she just randomly make a cameo for a song that she's not on? Like, Nikki really don't do stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, I am excited for the music video. Um, It does look nice. When it comes to music videos, Dolja Cat is completely on top of her game. Um, she's way better than Cardi B when it comes to music videos. Okay, I hate to do the comparison, but they're both female rappers. And everybody was talking about how Cardi B has the best music videos. Her music videos ain't better than Dolja Cat's. Sorry, not sorry. Um, hopefully she step up her music video game too, but I think it's because she be twerking and popping it in every video and Doja Cat don't really got to do that. Okay. Doja Cat don't. That's just the honest truth. So let me know if you guys are excited for the music video and if the remix ever comes, who would you want on it? Okay. I think it's a little bit too late for a remix, but let me know. Moving on to Kendrick Lamar. There has been a lot of whispers that Kendrick Lamar is dropping the same day as Nicki Minaj. Well, they're saying it's either the 4th or the 11th. I love Kendrick Lamar. I can't wait for him to come back. But it better be on the 11th. Okay? You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm not really worried about Big Sean and 2 Chains. I mean... When's the last time they made noise? In 2013? Okay, come on. I mean, my whole thing with Big Sean is he fell off. He's more concerned about his relationship with Janae. Okay? Um, and since then, his music hasn't been hitting like that. Okay? He might want to go back and have Kanye produce some beats for him. Okay? It looks like they made amends. He might want to go get that Drake collaboration again. Um, link up with Nikki because Big Sean fell off and he released an album last year. Or actually, I think it was in 2020. But with that being said, Kendrick Lamar, everybody is waiting on Kung Fu Kenny. And I want everybody to focus on Nicki Minaj. Okay? Now, I know he has to release because the Super Bowl is in two weeks. But he better come back on the 11th and not the 4th. We don't have time for the games. But if the industry tells him that he's releasing on the 4th, then he would have no choice. Okay? Because a lot of these artists, most of the time, they don't get to choose when they're able to release their songs. Okay? That's very rare for artists, especially when you're in a contract. You know, I think people want Nicki Minaj to be sabotaged, but... I think that the Barb's and Saul definitely have her back. As for Republic, I really don't trust them still. I'm sorry. I don't trust them. I think that they're full of it. Moving on to Drake, Kanye, and Julia Fox. The hip-hop publication XXL posted that allegedly Julia Fox and Drake had a fling. Why am I not shocked? Who hasn't smashed Drake? I mean, goodness gracious. How many people can you sleep with, Drake? This is why I call him Community D. I mean, goodness gracious. Now, Kanye 
probably is going to go crazy after hearing this. Even though I do not believe that he really likes this girl, Julia. I think he's using her. But at the end of the day, you know, Kanye always feels like Drake is after him. You know, if you watch his interview that he did on Drink Champs, he was like, oh, Drake is so strategic. He knows what to do. But Drake is just a whore, okay, in my opinion. Sorry, but I don't understand. How many people can you sleep with? Hide your wives, hide your moms, because when Drake sees them, ain't no telling what could happen. Now, I'm wondering... If that's who she cheated on her boyfriend with. Because she did an interview when she was in that movie with Adam Sandler. And she said she cheated on her boyfriend and she had to get a tattoo. I wonder if she cheated on her boyfriend with Drake. Mm -hmm. Now, a lot of people are saying, well, Julia Fox is not his type. That definitely is his type. I mean, she has somewhat of a big butt. It's not super big like Kim, but she does have a curvy body. She kind of reminds me of his baby mama. Only, you know, Sophie got a really strong face. But I think allegedly she got her nose done. With that being said, I do feel like Kanye is not going to be happy about this. Okay? Moving on to the queen of music, a.k.a. Beyonce. Um, it looks like Beyonce might be coming because three of her dancers posted um, the same picture. One of the picture was posted by her lead dancer, Ashley, okay, the one that got engaged. So with that being said, um, is Beyonce coming? Well, bitch, if you coming, come back in March, okay? Because Kung Fu Kenny and Nicki Minaj got February, okay? And I know Beyonce likes to do the surprise drops, but girl, you better wait till March, okay? Um, you know, I don't really care if anybody else drops as long as it's not a big artist because I don't want Nicki to be sabotaged. I want everybody to focus in on Nicki. I want to hear the bars, okay? When Nicki Minaj drops, we got to focus in on Nicki, okay? Because they trying to do a lot to sabotage the queen. So Beyonce needs to wait. Now, I think that they were just teasing the fans, telling the fans to get ready. I don't necessarily think that she could be dropping exactly the same time as Nicki, okay? Um, and besides... She's not performing at the Super Bowl, so it would make no sense for her to be dropping around the same time as Kendrick and Nicki Minaj. So let me know how you guys feel about that. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, and have an amazing day.